All right, today we're going to create some containers. We're going to borrow containers from the gravity folder and we're just going to edit them a little bit. We'll create some CSS rules. So for starters, let's go to and open up our website. I've been opening it up in the skin folder, but because I need to get to the container folder, I'm going to go ahead and open up into portals here. And uh, we'll go to default containers and we're going to open up the gravity folder and we're going to well first we're going to let's add a new folder and we'll call it the same as our skin folder that, that I had created new DNN skin you, whatever you had named yours is what you need to name it so all right we got that created and we'll take the title h2 from the gravity folder and I'm just going to paste it I just need to paste it a couple times there because we're going to do a couple different things all right and we got our website open and this is my uh, this is my test page here got just a little bit of content Close in edit mode just so you can see how those other panes collapse that I don't use. We'll go back to edit, edit mode here. We're going to first, we're going to take the first title H2 and we got it opened up here. And we're going to, we'll go ahead. We don't, we don't need the CSS classes that are in here. We're going to create our own. And we're going to do that right there. And just to show you what we have, this here controls, this part here, the H2 controls, if you go in and you give your module a title, right here. So, let me just change this real quick to mod title so you can see it. That right there. That is what this run at server H2 controls. Is that look and feel right there? This here controls uh, pretty much the entire look, and the content pane is where your actual stuff that you put into the module, whatever text, pictures, images, whatever, it goes into that content pane. This particular one's using a class of clear. Uh, I'll be honest with you right now, I don't think that's a bootstrap class. I'm not going to mess with it because it's not hurting anything. I think bootstrap has a clear fix class for clear and floats, but that's probably what that is right there. So anyhow, we're going to, uh, I got some CSS here, and this is going to be the uh, container title H2 that I'm going to go put in here. And we're going to give that, put that right here in this class. And we'll save that. And I'm just going to stick the CSS into the skin folder. You could put it to its own separate uh, CSS uh, file. But personally, I'm just going to put it in the skin folder because, it, because I can. I've already got it here, actually. i got max width. and So let's see what we have. This, this CSS right here is what I'm working with. Let's see what we have now. When we go add this module, let's say, let's go add it right here. Uh, let's add the container right there. So we'll go to uh, settings, page settings, and module container. We should be able to find it towards the bottom. Host new DNN skin title H2. That should be it right there. So let's see what we can do here with this. And there it is. Whoops. Because I have two heading twos in there. I need to get rid of one. I had just to show you real quick. I have my it's, it's targeting the H2. So I, I really don't need if I'm going to use the title for the module. I really don't need to be using another H2 because that's already an H2 right there. So let me go in here and just take out that H2 right there. And we'll just 
make a change here just so you can kind of see how it all works together uh, and if we close the edit mode you can see it is applied it's the padding margins what things I have set in the CSS already and because I set it at max width and max height, it's going to scale nicely there. All right. Now, let's say you don't want the title. Well, we can certainly do that. One way of doing that, let's go back to edit. It's just simply go in here and remove the title, right? Title will be gone. It still had the back background color because that is where the H2 tags are. But that's one way of doing it. Another way of doing it is actually, let's go back into here. Let's take a look at our second one we copied. Let's go back up here. Let's take uh, H2 and let's rename that to no title. So we're going to rename that one no title. And if you remember, I said these, this right here controls that title. So let's take that out. And we could take out this register right here because we don't need it anymore to, to control the title. We'll take that out. And we'll go ahead and take out the CSS classes here because we don't need that as well. That belongs somewhere else. Save that. Let's go add a no title one. Let's add it to this one. You'll notice I have a title of pain here. That's an H2 into my HTML in, in, that I put in the content, like like on the other one. But pain is where the title's at. So let's go and add a no, no title one here. Module container. And there's a new no title one. Let's update. You'll notice the word pain is now gone. What else can you do? You can add, uh, you can go to the components page on Bootstrap, scroll down towards the bottom, and you can add various, you know, classes that Bootstrap provides. Let's see, where's it at? I'm looking for Jumbotron here. Oh, really? Where's it at? There it is. It's just. Uh, we could add this here by just simply grabbing the class Jumbotron. Let's go here and let's grab that third one we had copied in there. And rename it to Jumbotron. And we'll come up here and we'll remove this CSS here. We'll add Jumbotron. And we don't need this either. So let's take that out. Now Jumbotron's a built-in CSS class, so we don't really have to do anything right now. So let me come here. Let's refresh the page. Well, first let's add it. Let's add Jumbotron. There it is. And you'll notice now it's got the format for Jumbotron. And of course it has the title in there, my mod title. So I could either remove this H2 tag right here to make it look right, or I could just, you know, go edit my Jumbotron, which is what I'm going to do here just to show you one more time, to be a no title. So let's just take out the H2, run at server, and let's take out the control, the title control here. And that's really all there is to it. Let's close this so we can see what we did. Remember, I removed the title there, but the title was there and can be put there with that one. This one's with the no title. That's no title with the bootstrap class Jumbotron. That's really all there is to creating containers. You could go, you know, you could do some really neat things. You can go look at skins at the dnn stores which is what i do all the time just looking at how they build build their stuff and it's just you know you can do a whole lot 
With a little practice, a little work, visit www.skeeterz71.com for this entire course and other courses for Illustrator, WordPress, Bootstrap, CSS, and a whole lot more. You have a good day.